Good morning guys and welcome to a new vlog. Today is Friday and I am going to Cycle Bar. It's been forever since I've been so I'm definitely going to be like out of shape and probably can't go as hard. Also too I'm tired because after I work like the week and stuff I always kind of need a day of recovery. <laughs> I know as silly as that sounds but it's fine. Um, this past week I did like neuro a neuro case and well i wouldn't say it's like hard hard but it's definitely a lot more challenging than like you know a circumcision so anyway just had kind of a wild week but you know we survived and it's the weekend now i don't have like any like plans this weekend so i'm playing it by ear and probably just gonna chillax so that's what's going on this weekend i have no clue really but i want to talk about the stanley real quick so i love my stanley it's so cute the straw is adorable i do like that the top part is like clearish because then i can like see where the level of the water is and that's why i love like clear water bottles and stuff so i love that you can have a visual of where the water is so that part's cool the straw is fine the straw topper the bow is super cute but it's honestly kind of annoying so i think i'm going to take it off i don't know i haven't decided yet it's part of the cup and i do think it's really cute it's just like kind of annoying so i don't know what i'm going to do with it but that's the only negative thing like the bow like bops all around when you know you're using the cup yeah and i don't want to like put it back on top of the straw every time because then like i just feel like that's just super filled with bacteria and like i kind of get grossed out but i know it's also gross to just have an open straw i don't have like a plan for it but i just know it's like annoying all right valerie piper tell us where we're going we're going to family dinner night aren't we Woohoo! Woo on friday yay family dinner night don't worry this one's here yay. <laughs> i know she's just like oh, yay happening? let's go we made it to family dinner night piper's thrilled valerie's thrilled yeah. sherry's thrilled Okay, so back in the car because Piper and I are going to Starbucks. Where else would we be going? Well, I was going to go to Cycle Bar this morning, but for some reason, like, my shins kind of hurt. I think it's because, like, I walked a lot more at work on Thursday because I was, like, in the hall. And then also, too, like, I had to run because I had to go to the bathroom really bad and I was running late because of an accident on I-4. So, I don't know. It's just, I think more increased like walking caused it and then i went to spin yesterday so i think my legs are just kind of like i don't really know the legs are kind of sore so we're just gonna go to starbucks and i'm gonna get cherry some breakfast and so i was thinking about what do i want for my birthday i think i want the celine version of these sunglasses which are like super expensive like if I end up getting those, those are the most, that's like the most money I've ever spent on like sunglasses, which I think is insane. But like when I look at sunglasses, I mean like the nice ones, that's how much they cost. The most I've spent on sunglasses is like $300 and I don't even like those. So I think I'm gonna put them on eBay to try to sell because I don't like them. The tint of the sunglasses themselves are like, it's too, right like i don't like them so i want to sell them but i don't know if they're gonna actually like do well i might put them on for like 200 and see if i get any money back on those but we'll see probably not um but i think for my birthday yeah i think i want the sunglasses because i love my ray-bans as you guys know and i got these cheap ones to see if i like these and i do i do like them and they're pretty popular right now. I know they're just a trend, but whatever, I like them. The other sunglasses I have were just a trend too, and I used them for like four years. So, and don't get me wrong, like I love those sunglasses so much, but yeah, anyway, I like these, and I think I want the real ones. So, I'm leaning towards those for my birthday. I really wanted the pochette accessories, or SS as people call it, but I'm like, that's 
rounding up like $1,500 plus tax. So that's not even really rounding up. And do I want to be spending that much money? No. I really wanted the Sony vlogging camera, but I talked to Karen from Kick and Baby J, and even though she likes it, it's like not her favorite. And like what she was saying about it, I'm like, eh, I don't know. I'll just stick to the G7X for like the smaller camera, even though this is more, just more better for photos, I think. It's great for vlogging, but I like the M50 a lot more for vlogging because of the wide angle lens. But I'm like, nah, I don't, I think I'm gonna pass up on that too. And then what else did I want? Oh, I'm gonna get the new iPhone probably because I always say I'm not gonna get it and then I end up just getting it. And for my birthday, like from my friends, a couple of my friends, I'm asking for Apple gift cards. So like I'll use the Apple gift cards to the like to pay for the phone or cases or like the screen protector. And then I will also do the buyback. That'll make the phone a little bit cheaper because of those two factors but I'm over here like since that's still gonna be pretty expensive so I don't know we'll see but if I get the sunglasses and then I get the new phone like that's a really good birthday present to myself from me and like my family too because my parents are like, what do you want? And I'm like, I was thinking like, oh, a Polaroid camera. So then I can like take pictures with like me and my friends and then put them in the back of my phone case. Cause I think that's a really cute trend and I really, really like it. However, I always end up just reverting back to like the Apple silicone case cause of like how it feels in the hand and like they're aesthetically pleasing to look at. So I'm like the likelihood of me having a clear case and having it be all like yellow and gross is not very good. So. I think I'm just going to pass up on the Polaroid camera for now or I'll just buy myself one or I'll ask for it for Christmas but yeah if my parents help me and just get give me a little bit of money for the sunglasses like that'll help me pay for those and then I can sell my other sunglasses hopefully I'll probably put them on for like 150 um, on eBay and then that'll also help the cost with the sunglasses so I can get the Celine ones and yeah so whenever I have like big purchases I try to like map out how I'm going to get the item without like just dropping the full amount because it is a lot of money and kind of annoying but it's fine another thing that was on my mind I swear this is just like a chatty vlog where I'm just rambling about my thoughts but you know what I like hearing people's rambles and thoughts so I was contemplating on selling the Louis Vuitton mini Palm Springs backpack and that was my most expensive bag like honestly I think that was a oh my gosh this truck is going so fast yeah the Palm Springs backpack was like literally the most expensive bag and like I don't even use it my hair gets caught in it I just don't know like I'm debating on selling that little guy because I just don't I mean it's super cute but like I don't even like backpacks anymore because then I have to like swing it around put stuff in it and then swing it back and then my hair gets caught on it and the mini backpack trend is like kind of out so like I'm not gonna pick that like the belt bag is more in style you know what I'm saying and it's like 40 bucks versus like that backpack that was like two thousand dollars so I'm like uh, maybe I should just sell that I don't know I swear I have these thoughts I'm like you know what I need to get rid of it if I don't use something like in my head I'm like I need to get rid of it and use the money towards something I'm going to use so I'm thinking because I really want a Goyard and the Goyard's about that amount. So I'm like, if I'm gonna go to a place that sells Goyard, I'm going to sell the mini backpack because I don't need the backpack. Sorry, Piper. Those are Alex's thoughts for today. No. Okay.
All right, so we're back. Piper did in fact get to come in because I didn't pre-order. So she came in, she got her little pup cup. She's happy. And also too, I went in and I was like, oh my gosh, I want a cake pop. So I got a cake pop and then Sherry got a breakfast sandwich. And here's Sherry's drink. Uh-oh, the lid wasn't on. Okay, there we go. That's better. Oh, spilled a little bit. I swear my car is filled with probably like all coffee. And then my drink. I don't like it when they don't like shake it up. So like I have to manually like keep stirring this thing. <laughs> uh, first world problems, but anyway, I love coffee so much. Also too, I posted on Piper's Instagram like her little picture of her sitting with her paws crossed on the couch. It's like a close up. I used the like portrait um, mode on my camera and I captioned it like a very demure, very mindful, cute and cutesy when I sit. So I'm hoping it like kind of gets some traction. If you don't know, if you know, you know, if you don't know, it's a thing on like TikTok. It's like demure is like the new word like slay was. I don't really know. But anyway, I thought it was funny. So anyway, I'm going to head home now and relax on the lanai drinking my coffee. Oh my gosh, it's so fun. I kind of live for just like the relaxing times. Oh my gosh, and there's this like big gray poodle right across from me. Okay, so I was just editing the vlog that you're seeing now, but I wanted to get content well, take photos, I should say. Um, and unbag this for you guys because it's been in my room for like probably a week now. It's my Fabletics little set. Let's see what I got. It's always like Christmas when I get these because I never really remember nor know what I'm going to get. So, oh, this is cute. I wear these tops like all the time, as you can see. This is actually Fabletics too. Um, this was like my very first post with them. Then we have this. Ooh, those are cute. These remind me of like, I don't know, those popular shorts people wear. I don't know. They look really cute. We have this. Oh my gosh, you can never go wrong with a black sports bra because I always wear these. This is really cute too. It has the Fabletics here and then this cool back. I think I'm gonna curl my hair and then get some photos in these because uh, I have nothing else to do and I'm in the middle, I'm almost done editing this video that you're watching now, so I just wanted to like throw this in at the end. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what the outfit looks like. I love it because it like accentuates my waist. I think it's super cute. And of course, I'm gonna like entitle it, you know, this outfit, very demure, even though that means absolutely that's the misuse of the word, but it's fine because it's like kind of a trend, you know? But anyway, this is what the outfit looks like. Hopefully I can get some like good photos in this. We'll see, we'll have fun with it. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.